Okay, before I start today's video, do you think that when Gypsy saw the Barbie movie that she saw this? And when she was going home with Ryan, this is what she got. <laughs> all right, all right, I'll get back to the main video now. Hey guys, I got a quick Gypsy Rose update for you. As you can see of this picture, that her and Mr. Ken, her ex fiance, are hanging out together, getting tattoos. Well, he's getting a tattoo. We don't know if she's got one or not, but people are thinking that maybe they got matching tattoos. I don't know, but they're obviously hanging out. See if I will leave Ryan to get back with him. You know anything about Gypsy's Instagram and you've seen the recent comments, she's not going anywhere. So it looks like what Jodie Lee said the other day is right, that her and Ryan, they've split. They're no more, and she's with her ex. We all knew she loved the ex. She was even saying how she still loved her ex, you know? She still has love for him. And that confirms all the theories, like she only got with Ryan for the parole. I mean, you know, he was a teacher. It looked good for her parole. And now that she's out on parole, she don't need him no more. Honestly, I think she should have waited it out a little bit longer. I mean, geez, three months isn't long, girl. And the D is? So clearly it looked like his D was not on fire. <laughs> she is back with the ex. And yeah, I mean, you know, they're all, all the rumors are coming out. You know, she's like Jodie Lee said, she's dyed her hair blonde because he likes blonde. We'll never be some blonde, fake ass, pretty ass bimbo that he's interested in. I do feel a little bad for Ryan because obviously he was played a fool here and he's basically ruined his life. Like he's going to have nothing at the end of this. You know, she's going to move on with all her money. I don't know what he's going to do. He's going to have to lay low quite a bit before he can, you know, get back into the workforce because what else is he going to do? You know, but hey, it's his own fault. He got involved with the notorious criminal. That's his, that's on him. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm curious what Ryan will say after all this is done, you know, what will he come out with? Because, I mean, I'm sure he has some stories to tell, you know, he's been defending her tooth and nail, but will he change his tune now that she's with her ex? You know, will he have a different perspective on things? I'm curious, I'd love to hear what Ryan has to say now. I just think he's a dumb mother girl. Everything's falling into place, everything's getting set in stone, and it's just one thing after another. And I mean, hey, we're living for it, we we'll keep watching. So let me know what you guys think. Did you see this coming? I think we all saw this coming, honestly. <laughs> but let me know. Let me know if you were shocked or not. And, you know, we'll keep watching and we'll keep we'll keep seeing what happens next. I really want to hear what Ryan has to say. I really do. So I'm going to be watching out for that. And I'll see you guys next time.